OSGI, we have changed our views on over the years. Uh, and one of the reasons is that OSGI simply cannot be made as easy to use and as productive as we feel is consistent with spring values. OSGI is a perfectly good technology, but over time we've come to the conclusion that it's really a niche technology rather than a mainstream technology. For example, OSGI is fantastic. If you're building a very platform specific environment where you kind of assembling your own server that has an unusual footprint, you know, OSGI is great for that. OSGI is also great for dynamic redeployment. So, you know, the Spring DM server product that we took to Eclipse um, as Virgo, I mean, this is, if you want to use OSGI, this is um, the best way to do it. But what we found in the server space is, you know, frankly, TC server is a much better fit for what people want. And I mean, in reality, it doesn't have the advanced module system, but I mean, it's got an incredibly small footprint. Uh, so, you know, the benefit that most users want is a server that has a really small memory footprint, good management, fast startup time. And, you know, you can get those things without the complexity of OSGI. Uh, 